might want to <laughs> might want to sort of demonstrate this. We, I don't think we're quite a playable. Um, uh, it's quite a similar game. It's a card game, um, so it works in a similar way. Um, it's called Relevance. Um, and the aim is to, uh, well, first of all, on an individual basis, to lose all your cards. So the winner is the person who's out first. Um, but the, uh, the learning aim is to create an effective search strategy. So uh, the dealer is going to deal five cards to each player. Um, you, you carry on, aren't you? <laughs> um, on each card, what we're doing is we've got, um, we, we've got a, a, a search task here um, and it's got three key concepts so we've got childhood obesity in the UK we've based ours on um, so we've got our three key concepts which are childhood obesity and UK and we've got a chart where they're going to build up their keywords because the idea is for them to find you know sort of additional search terms so um, the player to the left of the dealer start we've got a pile uh, the player to the left of the dealer lays down a card into the success, successful search box, which we don't have yet, um, which must contain all uh, words which mean, which relate to all the three concepts. Um, or, have you laid one down? No, because I've got crap out. That's okay. So, <laughs> or they must pick up from, uh, from, the, from the pile or one of the discards. Yeah. Um, they can't play that immediately, so the player passes to the next person. Okay. Um, when they lay down a card, let's hope you got one. No, I'll go with this one. Okay. You can't yet, because you've had a gun. No, I haven't. No, 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 I've been umming and ahhing about it. <laughs> I thought you picked up. Okay. No, 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 I was okay. about to. <laughs> okay, I want to put this down. I say it's relevant because um, I got early years children. Um, I've got the word obese for obesity and I've got United Kingdom, so I say that's relevant. That's and the group mean. has to agree whether it is or not. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And I then have to look at this and I've got United Kingdom is a synonym for UK. And I've got the word obese. It's not a fast moving game, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Because we're thinking about it. <laughs> and then I've got early years. <laughs> we think the value of this, seriously, we think the value of this is the discussion <laughs> that takes place, actually. Um, You'll go. <laughs> if, as you can see, you have to justify your decision if yeah. necessary. Infants, um, obese in Great Britain. Because that gets into infants, so obviously children, obese is relates to obesity in Great Britain is the inevitable for the UK. So I would say all of those key terms. That's the discount. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we've got another it's, not, it's just one to live in Great Britain. You wouldn't tell me you would just start with that. Oh, and okay. infants. So I'm going to lay down <laughs> Welsh because Wales is in the UK, so they may refer to it as Welsh children. Um, children, obviously, for childhood. And then health, because I'd say obesity is closely related to We might challenge her. We challenge her. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's way, way too vague. Mm, if it was related to obesity, the word would mean something or another. Health is way too general, so I would say no. And I'd agree with you. I'd agree. Yeah, I'd agree. Okay. So, so you have take to keep your card. You've been shamed. Stronger than a shame, And I mean, basically, uh, that's it. You carry on until you can, you know, one player has laid down all their cards. Obviously, if they can't, if they've got three or four irrelevant cards in their hand, then what they have to do is keep picking up from yeah, the card. Yeah, they pile. have to use a go to swap their card. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's similar to a lot of card games mm. and Scrabble. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. what they have at the end is the chart, which is in effect one of the charts that's often used for developing search strategies. So you've got your synonyms, and then maybe that could then be used by the, the, the lecturer to then do something on a database itself. They've done the basic thinking there. We thought that what you would have is you'd have sort of four or five groups of. Mm. You know, small groups of students doing this, so that 
um, at the end of the lesson, you would actually look at everybody's search strategies and have that sort of discussion. Brilliant, thank you. Is there any questions or comments? Okay. Are there different groups of students for doing it on different topics, or do all have that in? Um, well, we actually, we haven't thought of that one. We were playing with the idea of having more than one theme within a game, but we thought that would get mm. too complicated. I think one of the things that's mm. clear is the cards are going to have to be worked out quite carefully to make sure there's enough interest, enough points there for discussion. And it may well be that you just go with a generic topic like this that is topical, that most students are either English speaking or point of English as a second language can easily understand, even though it's not their actual topic. Mm. Uh, just so it's something you can really use with group after group. Yeah. 